Hello, I'm Vadim, and today we'll be looking at Enterprise Edition reports in Nagios XI. XI has different sets of reports based on if you have the Standard Edition or the Enterprise Edition. Regardless of your edition, reports help you visualize monitoring data and identify variations and spikes in that data to stay ahead of downtime. Now, let's take a look at the Enterprise Edition reports. If you have purchased the Enterprise Edition of Nagios XI, you should see a tab that says Enterprise Features. Here, you could click the reports and you'll find the Capacity Planning Report, Scheduled Pages, Scheduled Reports, Scheduled Report History, and SLA Reports. You could also find these options under the Reports tab. In SLA Reports, you could click on the Report options and change the time period and limit the results to a host, service, host group, or service group. Let's add exchange.nagios.com as a host and we will set the SLA target to 99%. After clicking Run, we see that it passes the SLA target, but if the report seems off, you could go to Advanced, then Hide Scheduled Downtime, Warning States, or Unknown Unreachable States. This will remove any outliers that might skew the SLA report. You could schedule this report by clicking the clock icon. Here you'll find some settings such as renaming the report, frequency and send time, attachments, recipients, subject, and attached message for the emailed reports. Moving on to the capacity planning report, it has similar settings to the SLA report but it has extra options to use extrapolation methods such as Holt Winters, Linear, Quadratic, or Cubic Fit. For our example, we will use Localhost. Below we have a few pages of different monitored services with current observed data and to predict future usage for services like current load. You can see that the observed data is in yellow and the predicted usage is shown in blue with the trend line being the predicted point at which XI thinks utilization will be at the time frame. You could also expand these pages by going down to the bottom and selecting 25 per page to fit all the services. Otherwise, you could adjust which service you would like to see in report options. To make a scheduled report, go to the top where we have the three dots and click Schedule a Report. This will email the entire list of services that are selected so that you could receive the report whenever you choose. To see all the reports scheduled, go to the tab labeled My Scheduled Reports. In here you'll find the reports that you have added, the subject, type, frequency, and recipients. On the right you have the options to edit, delete, view, or send the report right now. Above that, you can see the history of scheduled reports and some report email templates. And now you know more about the reports that are included in the Enterprise Edition of Nagios XI. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, check out our YouTube channel for more helpful content. I'll see you in the next one.